guys, so today I am here with my fifth Stitch Fix unboxing for you guys. If you are new to my channel and do not know what Stitch Fix is, I will link all of my Stitch Fix videos down below as well as the link to Stitch Fix itself. The FAQs tell you a lot better than I can say it, but I'm here with my fifth fix and let me tell you guys, this is literally the worst Stitch Fix I've ever gotten in my life and I'm saying that very positively right now because when I first got this, I was so pissed. Like, I was such an angry, angry person. For the first time in my entire Stitch Fix life, I peeked, and I have never peeked before. And you can peek on the app and actually see what the products are. And you can also peek on the website, but you don't get an actual, like, visual. So I peeked. And when I did, I was like, this is a joke. I accidentally put the wrong person's stuff in. Like, this is a joke. Like, if I get this fix, I'm going to be really, really agitated. But no, it was not a joke. It really came, and I am pretty frustrated with it, and I'll tell you why. So first and foremost, it came with my return bag. Surprise, I'm returning everything, but anyway. And then it also came with my customized letter and the price sheet, which I'll keep this out because I do like sharing my prices with you guys. This is my fifth fix, right? Yes. Okay, well, I'll just keep it right here. So my stylist this month is Adriana, and... Um, the note just like was weird in general and this entire fix is just weird and I'm just weird. Okay, so my camera's dying but I'm going to try and do this before it dies. So I'm going to show you guys everything. I just want to say that I, the reason that I do not like this fix is some of these clothes may be good for other people or some of you may like them and that's perfectly fine but they are not my style and you would think with doing five fixes they would see sort of like what I kept, what I sent back, what types of notes I've sent in, um, what my typical style is but this stuff is so off the mark that it almost makes me feel like it wasn't custom tailored for me like my past fixes have felt like I truly have felt with my past four fixes that they were like these stylists like went and like searched and found stuff that they thought I would like and with this one I feel like they just threw a bunch of stuff together and were just sent it out like without even thinking so the first thing is okay but it's not my style um, the first thing is this La Liz Torn Poncho Cardigan in Off-White it is a cardigan however it is like a poncho uh, kimono style cardigan and it's just not something that I typically like because I don't like the way the sleeves are because they're like connected I just don't feel like fully like functional in this type of cardigan um, however it is cute and it does have this cute like tribal lining but this is probably the one thing that I thought was like okay but I'm not gonna keep it because it is $54 and I know I would never wear it this is the Pixley Cruciatus Fringe Detail Top in black. This is $58, and it's like a black tank top blouse, which the reason I'm kind of frustrated with this is because I've gotten sent like a black tank top style blouse before. You guys have seen that, and I specifically said, you know, I don't really like that style of blouse. But I got another one, and this one's a little strange because it has like fringe all down like the top. And I thought that was just a little too much. I don't really like it that much. And like I said, this is $58. This is getting sent back. This top, I totally hate. Like, I really, I really hate this top so much. I feel like I'm such being, like, such a negative Debbie Downer in this video. I feel like you guys have to understand my pain of, like, going five times with a, you know, good stylist that picked good stuff for me and then getting a box that just felt like it was just thrown together. So I hope I don't get too many negative comments, but... I just hope you understand. The next top is, oh wait, that last top was, okay, never mind, they're the same price. But anyway, this is also a pixely top. This is the Amine Fringe Detail Knit Top in light gray. It's a gray t-shirt, which is um, nice, but it has like this weird fringe across, like across the boob. And that's so strange. It's a little boxy on me. And I also, I mean, I like that it's a gray t-shirt. And I think if it wasn't a sweater material, I would like it a little bit more. It's hot here in Texas. I can't be wearing a sweater anymore. It's a little too hot for that. So this is getting sent back. Um, I guess I'll save the best for last. I did get sent shoes, which I was really excited about. I've been wanting to get sent shoes for a while since they incorporated sending shoes now. These are the... Penny Loves Kenny Notice Laser Cut Lace-Up Flats, and these are $49. This is what they look like. 
these are cute they're cute but I am not into anything like this you guys know I'm either like sandals a like Vans or Nikes or like booties style girl so these are just not something that I saw myself wearing so these are also getting sent back and then I'm saving the best for last the last thing this is $98 these are the I'm not trying these on by the way because it's just it's highly embarrassing these are the Mavi Carry released hem denim gaucho I just don't even know. I got these, saw these in the the um, preview or the preview, the sneak peek, and I was just like, "This is a joke." They're gauchos. Like, like I would try these on so you could get a better look, but I would embarrass myself. Like these are so. I just. I did. I just. Like, like what? I just. I don't understand and she said in the note that she sent these because I said I wanted to try out edgier pieces and these are in like on trend right now and I'm like I've never seen these in my life first of all second of all on my style profile I literally put skinny jeans like the tightest jeans you can send me send me the tight ones because I love the tight ones these are just an embarrassment like I tried them on for Brian and I was just like, I can't, I can't, I'm embarrassed. Like, we've been dating for almost six years and I was embarrassed to go out there and show him these pants on me. And we've done a lot of weird stuff in front of each other. So, if that doesn't say anything. But, yeah, so this is a definite zero out of five for me. This is the first time I haven't kept a single thing. Um, this is definitely my worst fix that I have ever gotten. However, I am a sort of three strike person as far as subscription services go. So um, I'm hoping the next one is good because I would love to stay subscribed to Stitch Fix. Every other fix I've ever had has felt really custom tailored to me and I felt like the stylist put some effort and like actually looked at my style profile and looked at everything to sort of get an idea of what I like and this I just felt wasn't personalized at all and I don't know but I hope you guys enjoyed this video nonetheless go ahead and subscribe to my channel if you're not already and I will see you guys in my next video bye guys